Hey guys, welcome back to Bakes Foods. Today, we're gonna to be making pork ribs in a crock pot. Now these are just pork back ribs. This is just a small two pound um, rib rack. Just gonna season it up with salt, pepper, Let's put it in our crock pot, try it on low, and see what we get. So after opening our package here, we've rinsed off our rib rack, patted it dry with a paper towel. Now we're ready to season it. So I'm just gonna do a basic seasoning. Just gonna add about a tablespoon of salt. Just kinda coat it evenly. We'll do pepper. Gonna do the same thing to the other side and then we're ready to put it in our preheated crock pot. Okay, now we are ready to put it in our crock pot. So we're gonna put it in on its side like this. That way I don't, I, I think if I cut it up and put it down on the bottom, it's just gonna be a little bit too soggy. So I wanna maybe see if this will roast a little bit more if I keep it up sideways. So let's see what happens. Okay guys, once again, we've got our crock pot. I like to preheat it on high for a little bit while I'm prepping food. I don't know if that makes a difference. Now, we are ready to put our ribs in, and I'm just gonna put them in sideways like this. And hopefully let them roast in there. And then maybe, uh, I'll come back and check them in a couple hours and we'll see um, how they're doing. This size slab of ribs will be done in only a few hours, but to get them really nice and tender, we're going to want to shoot for that seven to eight hour window. Um, but we'll be checking it kind of periodically along the way just to see how it's going. I'm going to set this now to low and put it on eight hours and come check it after work. Okay guys, it's been about nine hours. I just got home from work. It smells amazing in my apartment. My absolute favorite part of crock pot cooking. Let's see what it looks like. Oh yes. Oh, it's falling apart. That's a good sign. Look at that. Now that looks good. All right guys. Not a bad crust for a crock pot, I'm not gonna lie. There's actually quite a bit of juice in there still. Make a nice little sauce out of that or something. Anyway, let's, uh, let's give this a try. 